gonna be okay? We'll get some help here. Soon this will all be just a bad memory. I don't think the bad memories are over yet. This is the place. If we end up with any memories at all. Honestly, I'm surprised we're already here. I didn't think... I guess this is like the halfway point. Ring-a-ding-ding! -ding. I was gonna say, don't make me do it again. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Well, oh, he wasn't hard to convince. Don't be shy. Well, you'll have to forgive me for being a little on edge. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of... Our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. Does he, so, does he know that we're androids? The way he said that. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Maybe he recognizes our model or something. <laughs> Deviant, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. Uh, yeah. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. I don't buy this. If we had trackers in us, this way, everything we need is in the basement. Why wouldn't they have been using that all this time to catch us? They would have gotten us already. Something is definitely not right around here. Just having to look around. In the basement, you said? Yeah, that's... <laughs> I 
That doesn't bode well for us. I don't like this place. And that man. Let's go, I have a bad hey, feeling. Kid, he can hear you. I know. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet. For What's happening machines. here? Removing trackers is a Okay, kid, do you want to hold my hand or not? I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be alright. That's good. Come on, Alice. This way, please. God, my camera is like inside Luther. All of this to remove a tracker? Yeah, I'm, I'm calling BS on this operation. If you could just stand over there. Ah, shit. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. This seems overkill, man. <laughs> First person. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviants. That's why it's so hard to find them. Oh, well, we do have trackers. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah, the... People believe what they want. You deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them, sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's, that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Luther. <laughs> Luther, you can stop this, man. Oh, fuck. What did you do to me? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, at least it's going slowly. Maybe we have time. That's what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way. Tears and disillusionment. Believe me, you're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. That's not for you to decide. No more hopes dashed. I almost envy you. Kara! <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. No! Oh, Wait. Looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like mommy's completely forgotten you. Kara, what <laughs> happened to you? Oh, Fuck. All right, that's enough. Come on. It's only at 16%. <laughs> Maybe my most recent memories got wiped first. I'm going to teach you some manners, you little bitch. Meet me in the living room. All right. Shit, I think it's speeding up. We gotta get out of here. What can I do? Okay, so I, I know we can mess with these cables. Uh, da, 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 da. Cause a short circuit. Is it vodka? Is it the green cable? 
Okay. Worth a shot. I don't think that did anything. <laughs> oh my god, we're at 67%. Oh god, oh god, oh god. B. I don't, I don't know, I'm just gonna start breaking shit. Come on! No, 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 no! I'm screwed, aren't I? I think it's inevitable. I don't know what else to do. Oh shit, okay. This is, uh, cool. Things are about to get real intense. I was hoping I could avoid it. I don't think that's possible. Help us. Cannot mess this up. Oh my. You must remember who you are. Otherwise the little one will die. We'll get there, piece by piece. I believe. What is that guy's story? Why is he all alone and the others are in the other cell? Alright, he said to meet him in the living room. Uh, I guess we'll do that for the time being. We need Luther on our side. I know I looked at these already, but I don't know what could potentially jog my memory, so I'm just gonna interact with everything I can. Yeah, I didn't, uh, <laughs> I didn't think that would work. Uh, there's something over here. Or clothes. Make yourselves at home. Master's dinner's ready. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. In a moment. Is there nothing else in here? I mean, I, I know I walked around here already. But now that we're viewing things through a different lens, I thought maybe. There we go. You want to find a safe place? Somewhere you can start a new life.
Uh, I don't suppose... You didn't tell us what room he's in. I'm guessing, is it the one with the open door? Oh, yeah, here he is. Uh, just set it down on the table over there. This table? That's, uh, <laughs> I didn't really look at what was on the tray. That's quite the meal there. Get rid of that carcass. Uh, take it next door. It's took off out of work. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking accountant! Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lacko. Dude's got potato chips and cookies. <laughs> Pretty much. And I don't even want to know what kind of Frankenstein monster he's creating. Can I sabotage anything in here? Probably not while he's in the room. Yes, Lacko. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Understood, Slacko. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Somebody is... okay. <laughs> we got ten minutes. You have to remember. Is there anything in here? Hello there, friend. You're gonna help me. I know you are. Oh, this. <laughs> this will jog a memory or two. I can't take the risk. I'm sorry, dude. You can always just plug it back in, right? Zlotko can revive you if he survives. <laughs> I can't be exposed. Alright, seven and a half minutes. Where is this kid? There's too many rooms in this damn house. Oh, hi. Uh, nothing suspicious going on here. in here, I guess? I mean, it would make sense. He was guarding her room. World War III. Oh, boy. Lovely. <laughs> Word gets out fast. Oh, 
Hello there. It's not loaded. Well, we could still take it. So Zlatko can't use it. I'm sure he knows where the ammunition is. Wait, do I still have my gun? I don't know, actually. What the sh- God, God damn it, I didn't mean to do that. Go back in. No. It's really frustrating, because, like, sometimes I'll be walking and just using the right stick to, like, pan the camera around, but then I'll, I'll walk next to an interactable object, and it'll, it'll like, automatically start interacting with it. Wait, what did I just do? I want to burn this place down, man. I want to take Marcus's arson to the next level. But I don't think we have the option to yet. In the last door, the freaking last room I check. Of course. Hey, we can still make some good out of this. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Free the others. And hopefully we will make a very valuable ally. Luther! Where is he? Yes, Lock. Go, 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 go. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zach. We need to hide in a room. Come on. Hide. Oh shit. Okay, maybe we can sneak our way out of here. Maybe we don't have to burn the place down and get shot at by a shotgun. But then, oh, I don't know. Not go. What? The little one is gone. Fuck it. I don't know. They're already onto us. Let's just. just we're doing this. What are you waiting for? So much for hiding. Yeah, we gotta get out of here. Alice, Alice, get your ass over here. Come on, let's go. Is he in this room? It sounds like his voice is coming from in here. Oh, shit! Where is he? Wait, are we good? I, I... He went... God, how did he not see us? I don't know. Is Latko still in his workshop? Oh, fuck! We gotta go, we gotta go, 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 go! Oh, shit! He's onto us. Back door, back door. Front door was locked. We learned that earlier. Alice! Go, Alice! No! I won't leave! Go! Run as fast as you can! Well, I got shot at less than last I time. Warned you. <laughs> Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. 
Oh shit. How dare you? How dare you? What are you doing? Who let you out? Your little palace of pain Get is away. over, man. Get away from me! Obey me! I'm your master! I'm your master! Deserved. Oh, so we could have chose to hide, but I wasn't sure if we would end up getting Luther to join us if we took that route. We need this guy. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I could protect you. You and the little one. All right. I trust you. Wait, how come- oh, interesting, I didn't even get a choice. I'm pretty- I feel like last time I had the choice I was so scared of losing you. whether I wanted to, tr wanted to trust him or not. Huh. Okay, yeah, I guess- <laughs> I guess I lied earlier. The, the polar bear didn't end up having to help me after all. Last time it saved my life. Oh, so does he join us, like, no matter what? Is that the only end? Or I guess this is another option. Yeah, see, bear attack, slot code, protect Kara. So we did better. Oh boy. She's not going to be too pleased that uh, we didn't capture Rupert. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. A pity you didn't manage to capture it. I have no excuse. I should have been more efficient. Did you manage to learn anything? I did miss something. I found its diary. But or maybe that's only unlocked if I It may take weeks to decipher. Do you capture it. Hmm. What else? It was hard to tell. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I think the media knows already. I won't disappoint you. <laughs> a new case just came in. 
Find Anderson and investigate it. Tara's already made the news. She's been on the front page of a magazine. Well, we managed to make Hank our friend. I would like to keep it that way. Anything else out here? Although... I don't know, just showing up at his house, maybe not the coolest thing to do. <gasps> Sumo! But when you don't answer your phone, I'm assuming we tried calling him first. Sumo! It's a good boy. Oh shit. <laughs> That's right. Lieutenant Anderson! Oh, I hope you don't mind. I'll pay for it. Easy, Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Yes. I don't know what's better, being friends with Hank or being friends with Sumo. This dude is out. Holy shit. At least he's not dead. But it seems like he damn well came close. Why do you have this in your hand? Lieutenant. Wake the fuck up, dude. Come on. Wake up, Lieutenant. It's me, Connor. I'm going to sober you up for your own sake. Hey! I have to warn you. Leave me this alone, may be unpleasant. fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. That was weird. They were like, Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. Talking over each other. I don't think that's supposed to happen. Hey! Come on, dude. Sumo, attack. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> attack. I need you, man. I'm gonna be sick. We're gonna be partners, whether you like it or not. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you I'm doing? not grumpy, I just don't like you. <sighs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. Like I said, you don't have a choice. <laughs> What the fuck are you doing here? Yeah, it worked like the a charm. The homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <laughs> <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. 
I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! Why would I tease him? I'm not gonna I understand. tease him. I sincerely hope you come to terms with your personal situation. This homicide, what do we know about it? A man was found dead in a sex club downtown. The report says that an android may be involved. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. He's coming around. Honor can be very persuasive when he needs to be. Even when it doesn't seem like it. What do you want to wear? Even when he's not even trying to. <laughs> oh. Hippie, stripey, streaky. What are you feeling, Hank? I'm feeling streaky. We should have a chance to look around here in a minute. Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> In the meantime, I hope you don't mind, I'm, uh, gonna have a look around. Oh, doesn't she look familiar? Hi, Sumo. You could doggo. Uh, there's a surprising lack of things to do in here. What's this? Records? Hank loves jazz. Well, he also loves heavy metal. <laughs> Interesting combination. I, I better not. <laughs> Looking streaky. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. As if you have to tell him. When is he not a good dog? Ninety percent, huh? Is it because I didn't watch the TV? <laughs> or 
Or maybe... Hmm. Was there something outside I didn't see? I would say maybe it's probably not possible to get 100% in, in a single go around. Uh, I think it's including like certain decisions. So like I would have to replay it and maybe get attacked by Sumo or whatever the alternative is to calming him. And then that would increase our percentage probably. Cyberlife Warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. All right. Well, I I will trust North. I don't know if I if I have a choice in the matter. But it's not like I know where to go. Arcus seems to know. I'm surprised he's not leading a charge. Shit, wait, is there a guard? Oh, everyone else is going. Oh shit! Watch out! Now what do we do? I'll find another way. As long as it's stealthy. <laughs> In another life, I learned. North likes to do things... ...aggressively. Put it that way. I'm really shocked nobody sees us up here. Making all this noise, jumping around. Marcus, climb up here. Follow north, follow Simon. Follow north. Simon's way was faster. All right. What's the plan? Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave that to me. Leave it to me. Like I read his mind. Or I've played it before. <laughs> well, I actually didn't remember exactly what he would say in that moment. I knew it would be our responsibility. That looks like a terrible idea. Let's try this way. Nope. Okay. Go around to the left. This looks like a fall to our death. I had a feeling. Where do I go from here? Oh, I see. Okay, wait for it to move, then jump. And then button mash. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, I think never stood a chance. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Thank you. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. All right, let's make this quick. Gimme, 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 gimme. What are you looking at? Oh, fuck. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence. Hey man, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. We're, we're, we're one of you. I will notify security. Uh, no, 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 no. It's not necessary. It's not necessary. Just. Where is it this time? Shit. Kill guard. Run away. Come here. John! I need your help. Everybody John! play cool. Oh shit, he's gonna see the knife. Fuck. I trust you. You're one of us there now. You are. What the hell are you doing? I was inspecting the platform. Everything is in order. Good. Then I'm going back to the control station. I'm soaked. Take the drone to maintenance and make a report. Understood. You've made Let's the right choice, friend. Welcome to the club. Try to find some blue blood. We still don't have enough. Well, there's still crates we haven't opened. Give me a break. I just saved our asses. Or I guess the other guy did. But I convinced him. Counts for something. Oh, this... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I guess depending on your point of view, I was going to say, this is probably where they keep the good stuff. Definitely the valuable stuff. Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? One of us. One of us. I wish she was looking at me, I thought she might be upset, like, oh, we can't take all of them, we'll get caught, or something. That's what I was expecting. Take me with you. He's on their side, we can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us, it's too dangerous. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Here's the debate. They come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. We need people. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. Ooh, I don't know. I mean, more stuff is good. He makes a good point, though, about... It's not worth the risk. Carrying capacity. Oh, I God, yeah, they do not give you a lot of time to make that choice. the quickest way out. Okay, then. Let's go. I think... Safe is better than sorry in this case. We got what we came for. He's right. I'm not sure I really want to risk 
pulling a stealth operation. It's just like, okay, what? We're going to hijack a truck and drive it back to Jericho? I don't know, man. I think that was probably the right call. We have blue blood and bio components. There will be enough for everyone. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not going to take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah! It was a hell of a speech. I don't know about the taking part, though. I mean, yeah, we did just steal, so. <laughs> Guess it's too late to be innocent, but. I don't want to do anything by force. You know, I don't want to hurt anybody. We need to solve the public opinion crisis that Kara started. <laughs> uh. 